hard to support my family as I was growing up, but we were frequently struggling um, to get by. When my siblings were born, my mother had to return to work within a few days after giving birth. Later, as the oldest in my family, it was often my responsibility to care for my siblings when they got sick. This, of course, meant I missed days of school so that my parents wouldn't have to miss a day of work. For my family growing up, and for so many families in my district, a lost day of work meant choosing between putting food on the table or paying for rent. No Oregon family should, should ever have to make that decision. However, many Oregonians all across the state are living the same experience as I did. House Bill 3087 will provide economy, excuse me, will provide economy-wide benefits by reducing spending on public assistance programs and increased labor force participation, which will generate a large tax base and increase consumer spending. This bill also benefits employers, especially small businesses, that would never be able to afford this kind of program, but can now compete with large corporations that currently offer paid family leave. Providing paid family leave for working Oregonians is the right thing to do, and I believe now is the right time to do it. <clears throat> I urge your support on the bill. Thank you for the opportunity to speak before you. Thank you very much. Do any members of the committee have any questions for Yes, Representative Pack. Thank you, Chair. Thank you for being here. A couple of quick questions. Um, how does this bill differ from the Federal Family Leave Act? So the bill, uh, Chair Lively, Representative Pack, the bill that's been introduced at the federal level or the current Family Medical Leave Act? The current. Well, it differs in that there's wage replacement. And so you have protected family leave at both the state and the federal level. And I know there are people in this room who know this better than me, um, but uh, it doesn't replace your wage. So it protects your job, but it doesn't replace your wage. Okay, one more. Sure. Thank you, Chair. So um, you had mentioned that this helps small businesses. Mm -hmm. So does the employer pay for the time off or do they not pay for the time off? And if so, how does that help a small business? Yeah, that's a really good question. And I think we have experts in here who can break that down for you as okay. well. The next group, I Great. Think we'll go Thank you. It. Appreciate it. Any other questions for our three representatives? Thank you, Thank you. for Thank you. coming.